Texas. Here we are. Our first real vlog in Texas. We're about to meet up with El Picasso GTI and his buddy with a TTRS. We're gonna do some racing tonight. I actually haven't met him yet in person, so this will be cool. Like he, uh, him and I, well he created the Facebook page, but it was kind of my idea for the MQB Street Racers. So if you know the, of that page, um, yeah, we kind of started that, so. But he got off social media for a while and I gave, I couldn't keep the group handled. It was just too much of my time, so I gave it up. But, uh, you know, we started that. Should be some fun runs tonight. I'm excited to finally meet him in person and uh, here we are, it's just a random Thursday night and we're going racing, so that's pretty freaking awesome. <laughs> Had to run into the good old H-E-B here. My stomach freaking was not okay. But, uh, finally got to meet up with the homie. It looks like someone else showed up too. Another GTI. Right on. Should be a real fun night. Where's the EQT badge? Boom. Skirt. Let's get it. This will be fun. We got this GTI. Uh, I think it's the IS38 Plus on the 85. And then uh, we got another GTI here. He's IS38. Should be some good runs. This is a continuance of last night's video. I didn't really record a whole lot. But I'm here dropping off a uh, application at Porsche. Maybe be a Porsche tech. Running up here on this one. Just take a look inside and look at the little shifter. It looks very, very similar to mine. I actually like wanted to get almost one that was exactly like that with the R&D on it. So that's pretty cool to see. Even though mine's like some Chinese knockoff. But uh, they have a lot of cool shit here. Hopefully I can get in here and talk to a service advisor or something today, but how cool would that be working at Porsche? It's sick, I really like this blue. I have Scorpion there. Oh, that thing just jumped. He's playing dead. That's crazy. These dog. These again dog. These again dog. Oh, the one wagon left. I should have got a video of that one. All types of stuff. Nice, nice cook out here at Ricky's. Oh yeah. Of course, we got to show this off. Shit right here. This shit right here. Yeah, this is legit. So good. So so good. All the dash switches. You got the all the things. So good. 
bye. Say bye. I want to hear this thing fire up. Brand new forty million dollar Porsche dealership. It's pretty sick. Be really cool to work there huh well this video is just all over the place over the past week of being here I haven't had a whole day of just vlogging or doing anything yet just because well i live in a freaking hotel so anyway we got some of our tools out went to the store got some books for the daughter we're gonna check plug gap we're gonna do some some rate we did some racing this past weekend but i want to make sure my plugs are good oh it's looking good and everything but i want to check plug gap every three thousand or so miles so i want to get a I look at these, see how they're, see how they're looking. We got our nice Pro Bolt hardware with our O34 heat sink to cool packs, and I'm just gonna yank these out real quick, check them, regap them if need be, and uh, toss them back in. Should be a good weekend. Uh, the next video you guys should see would be uh, the Saturday big Audi Club uh, San Antonio meet. We're meeting up at some brewery and stuff and then we're going to austin and and doing this whole cruise thing so should be a fairly neat saturday and then uh come the end of next week temperatures are dropping drastically like 20 degrees and uh so next friday night should be really really sick with the lower temperatures going up racing so let's see how these look all right guys i am thoroughly the frick impressed We'll just grab one of these bad boys real quick. Let's see if we can get it to focus. Let's see if we just zoom here. The plugs look phenomenal, and I mean phenomenal. Maybe that's a little too much zoom for detail. But they look really, 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 really good. There's about 8,000 miles on these, and they look just pristine. Only one um, cylinder two was out of spec. It was at like 0.25 or 0 0.0255 ish i barely had to gap it all the rest are still at 0 0.024 like i had them and i am just i'm happy that is awesome also went into obd 11 real quick while i was doing all this there's a bunch of new one click apps for this car um you can get like the torque monitors in there uh like the rs cars there's uh you know we have windows down with the key fob from the factory but now they enabled it to do the windows up um, they took that away in the newest gen because of pedestrian safety bull crap. And there's a bunch of other cool stuff in there. But um, main thing here, spark plugs look great. Zero three fours tune, E85 for quite some time now. Doing really, 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 really well. But props to them. I'm going to take some pictures and send that over to them and give them some props because that's just awesome. Didn't end the last video, but here we are with the Audi Club along with some other v-dubs starting our our cruise for the day back at it with an update so i have only ever seen one rs4 in person and that was in albuquerque probably five six years ago and now there's another one here and then another one just pulled up over here there's three of them here we got this r8 that showed up man that's what I want. I want the hood vents. Sexy. Seen these emblems on uh, Instagram and stuff. This guy makes them custom. Man, I love these. It's the old five cylinder in this. Very cool. We got the R8 over here. It's got gated manual in it. Check that out. Nice. Man, I would love one of these. Sick. Bring around the posy. You got a seashell? Seashell. Really good. Well, is that bird by itself? 
We're at some place called the Shady Llama. Yep, I was a follow the leader. <laughs> nice. Interesting spot in the middle of somewhere. What do you think, kiddo? The dirt? <laughs> you go see some llamas? <laughs> Look at ya! So cute! <laughs> swing, swing! Well, I didn't really record much of our drive because you get one half a gear pull and then uh, you're back to traffic again. <laughs> Me and the old lady here are comparing this S5 to my my three, and it's interesting that this grill is shiny and it kind of makes it look like that it's open from like back here. It kind of seems like it's open, but it isn't. And mine's matte, so you can't. You definitely know that the crash bar is behind it, but this one kind of hides it. It's interesting to see the, the similarities and the and the differences. I'm surprised it doesn't have more of a, a thing there, whatever you call it, a little vent. Mine's, it's not real there at the hood, but I'm surprised this doesn't have that. And this has fogs, so we don't get a fog option. It's interesting. It's got his windshield tinted and it looks really good. You guys know me, big Joe Rogan fan, so I had to stop down here and find the mothership. I think that might be it right there. Right Where do you see it, babe? Oh, yeah, it does. Yeah, right there. Mothership. How cool. Hopefully, I can just throw my blinkers on like that asshole up there and uh, take a picture. Very cool. Austin is definitely interesting. Got the D building there. All types of people. I don't know what these guys are lined up for. On our way back, running into this random arcade. Man, I want to run. There's so much traffic. Oh, this is like the worst. Man. 